Mike, I just got asked, like, what have the last few weeks been like for you? I imagine it's kind of been a whirlwind. Uh, I would say it's actually, like you said, it's been a whirlwind a lot in the past two to three weeks. But, I mean, once I got here, I was ready to get to work. And, I mean, I'm, I'm a rebel now, so I'm happy to be here. Yes, and your thought process and, and, and leaning and coming to Ole Miss, uh, we know obviously kind of the return specialist aspect, but do you see yourself as maybe getting the opportunity in the receiving game as well if, if, if they need you to? Yes, sir. I feel, my, I, I feel like my skill set is very versatile and I could be used in the passing game, the running game. But, I mean, ultimately I feel like a big pivotal part of my like playmaking skill set is the return game, and so I'm really looking forward to doing it. You were intending to stay at Utah State, right? Then when Coach Anderson was let go, can you kind of what happened in those kind of couple of days after that that led you to decide to get into the portal? Um, I'm actually really close with Coach Anderson, and so when he got re when he got released and let go, uh, I mean it definitely it definitely hurt. And I mean I didn't really have that close of a relationship with the new head coach, but I mean I was still I'm still cool with him. Like he's he's a great guy, but ultimately I just felt like it was best for me to step away from that program and look to play somewhere else. Have you communicated with him at all since he was let go there? Um, I haven't communicated with him in about a few few weeks. I think the last time was probably the day or two after, but uh, ever since then, no. Like, uh, just looking at this receiver's room that you were walking into on paper, I mean, it, it looks crowded. What, what um, from your thought process, why did you want to come here anyway, looking at the, the group of guys you're going to have to compete with? Uh, I saw the group, and I, I kind of pictured it as I'm ready to compete. I wanted to come compete against the best, play with the best. And when I looked at the receiver room, I, I felt like that's exactly what they had, the best receiver room in the country, and that's what I want to be a part of. I know you're a re returner, and you said you're a versatile receiver, but what what in particular, what, what is the scouting report on Micah Davis? Um, I would say when you look at me, it's a – Jack of all trades. Uh, I feel like I could I could take you on a deep ball. I could take you on a intermediate routes. I feel like I have a very, like I said, versatile set of skills, and I feel like it could be used in multiple facets. And I know you were running the triple option a, a couple years ago. Is it crazy to look at the offense that you're now compared to that? Uh, it's definitely a huge change from what I originally came came to college to play. And, you know, but I feel like the, at, with that being said, the triple option, it kind of helped me understand, like, the basics of an offense and playing your role and knowing how to help other people play their role. Thank you. Thank you.